Ooh, man. Woo. So I just got out of an early, early screening for Zendaya's new movie, Challengers, and these are my spoiler-free thoughts. This movie was great, man. Starting off with the plot, man, bro, such good writing. And, and I mean like, and I mean that. I loved how the story captured how these two guys are just obsessed with Tashi or Zendaya's character. And honestly, it's just a messy situation. And I mean, and I mean messy. Imagine having to marry this man and then you have him facing your ex in the tournament. One thing I will tell you guys is that there is a lot of kissing, a lot of kissing. And I'm gonna be honest with you guys and come out and say it. This scene right here is not what you guys think. It, it's not, you, you have to just see it for yourself. But next we have to highlight Zendaya's performance because she actually did an amazing job. Like really giving us that euphoria style acting for real. Also Zendaya with short hair. Oh my God. But I will say she is a manipulator and a master powerhouse in this movie and I love it. The lighting was on point and the music absolutely devours in this movie, man. The music choices were really on point and really highlighted the intensity of some of these scenes. Mike Feist and Josh O'Connor really do a great job as well. There are some moments in this movie that is going to have your jaw on the floor asking, why did this person do that? I'm not going into details, but just keep that in mind. And let me just say, Luca G absolutely ate with the directing in this movie. The cinematography is my favorite part about the whole film. I'm not gonna specify, but there's a few first person moments that happen in this movie and it just had me cheesing. Not gonna lie, walking out of that theater, I was like, I need to take tennis matches more seriously now. Also, we really need to put Zendaya in more sports movies because she really did great. Y'all already know me and the boys was outside for this one. But overall, I have to give Challengers a four out of five. Great story, great plot, great characters. The stakes were also pretty good as well. The ending was insane, and the ending is actually part of what makes this movie so great. But when you guys go see it, I will elaborate more on that. The entire story is just a buildup. It is all a buildup to a one present moment. Now, one thing I will say, there are some slow moments that happen in this movie, but for a good reason. Some things kind of just don't add up, but then you figure out why later. And yeah, all I'm gonna say is this movie really left me speechless by the end. I I'm still thinking about that ending, dude. But when this movie comes out, please, I highly recommend you go see it, especially if you're a Zendaya fan like me. Be sure to go follow my letterbox for more movie reviews.